So what I've got up here is my oscilloscope connected to the solar light. Now I've got channel one connected to pin one, which is on VDD. So here, and channel two connected on pin four, which is the LX, which is the output to the LED. Um, so what I'm going to, have to do is show the voltage from the solar panel and the operation of the chip, the YX8018, in operation and use. So looking at the oscilloscope, we can see the yellow line, channel 1, and blue line, channel 2. And channel 1 is the voltage of the cell. Um, if I... You can just about see... Let's move this a bit. Um, so just here, we can see I'm measuring the voltage at the positive of the cell. Now if I cover this we can watch the voltage drop down to 80 millivolts let it back up. Now what we can do is turn up the lights I've got on my desk and we can watch that voltage increase and get 1.12 volts. Um, if I use a torch it's much brighter we can get 2.6 2 2.7 volts out of the cell back down to 1.12 now if we cover this up obviously we've got this switch turned off at the moment so it's not really doing anything um, so what we're going to do is turn down the lights a little bit leave it about there and we're going to switch the switch on you can see now on channel 1 we now have 1.28 volts this is the voltage of the battery but now if we turn down the lights we can see channel 2 is now switching on and off now this is the output from LX um, and we can see here the voltage for it is just over 3 volts um, and this is the switching FET in the IC switching at 240 kilohertz um, and with the inductor we can boost the voltage to run the LED so we have an LED that's on and we, if we bring the lights up we can see that stop Just thought that was a bit interesting, people might want to see.